Hey everyone, in this video, we are gonna go over a meta CTF challenge called Cheese. Currently, it is worth 150 points and this box is retiring. So that's why we're doing the video. Now, you are gonna get a file here just called Cheese. Spoiler alert, I already downloaded it. So I'm going to bring it up in my terminal here. Now, it doesn't have a file extension. So one of the things that I like to do first is run an XF tool on the file to see if that can give me a hint as to what this file type might be. And here it has it listed as a Mac O executable. I'm gonna be honest, I did not know this file type before. So I Googled it and it turns out it is a binary file uh, meant to run on Mac OS or iOS. And binary files aren't uh, very human readable. So if we were to open up this file in Vim here, just a you know regular text editor, we can see this doesn't give us uh, a ton of useful information, but we do see that there are some uh, letters and words that we do recognize. So in this case, I would run a, another program called strings. And if I can spell strings right, strings, and then you can see cheese, <laughs> get it anyway. Okay. So running strings and cheese will uh, show you all of the kind of human readable text that is in that binary file. And if you kind of look to see what is here, this one, uh, the more I see, the less I see, that would be the flag. It's kind of what looks most flaggy. So if you were to type that into uh, the meta CTF challenge, that is what you would need to do. So strings is an awesome program um, to kind of, like I said, pull out that binary uh, uh, human readable text out of the binary file. Now we're gonna be doing more of these videos, so make sure to subscribe and uh, check out the Meta CTF Cyber Range that we have through Anti-Siphon. And uh, I will see you in the next video, bye.